All right, I am back. I am putting, I put them under, got my, so I will be using some glitter. And how you use that, I will show you. You'll need a sponge on one of my fingers. I will be using gold foil. All right, so let's get started. So back to what I was asking, what will your plans be for this week night? I am staying home, going to watch Bobby Bones on in Nashville. That's my plan. We need some garbage pants. All right. So what I'm going to... Oh, I forgot. You're supposed to... All right. So when you open them up, you want to test the size. I'm leaving these still because I haven't decided what I'm going to do with that. And so then you add, put it down and tear off. I like to tear, pinch them, tear it off. Oh, since I added the black, I push down and you try not to put it on the, over your cuticle. And so what I'm doing with this one tonight, it's called a peekaboo peek. And so trying this one, this side, my previous mannings, I put the solid on this side, but I want to try it with the peekaboo on the inside of my finger now. All right, so as you can see, I got some on my, on the edge. And I can do that cleanup. I got my stick. As you can see, I did get some on my cuticle. I like to get it right up so then I don't have to do any cleanup edges from on that side where my cuticle is. And then I tuck it under so if there's any shrinkage and my preference of when to put do these is at night so then I have time for them to cure but I don't have that much didn't do it there you go. And you always want to start with your pinkies and then work into your thumbs. Small pieces. All right. I was thinking about doing a um, V shape, V shape, um, tip, French tip, but I changed my mind and I did not want to. 
Oh, let's fix that so it doesn't do that to me again. Because I think that's what it was. Okay. Well, I gotta learn to stay in frame as well. Since I'm gonna be start starting to do my manis for you all. I didn't quite get it close enough to the edge. Okay. So I did, I think I did this set last was back in October, I think, for homecoming. Because Fredonia's school colors are black and gold. All right, so. What I'm doing right now is put, pressing everything down, tucking them all under. If you happen to hear some music, I apologize. I don't own the rights to it. I need to learn to turn it off or mute it when I'm doing these because eventually... I'll be posting. I will be posting on YouTube. So my pinkies are done. Now I'm going to do my rings, which I'm going to go show something that you can do. Instead of always having to go this way, I'm going to go sideways. So. This is my first time attempting to, oh, and it, she, can you see that? I don't know if you'll be able, to... that gold is very sheer. So what I'm gonna be doing with this gold is putting it over this gold. And I was actually wanting to do, um, use, um, Go, um, stay golden and then put the gold flakes but I saw this technique on a mani that I saw posted today or yesterday I'm like oh I'll go sideways I'm gonna try something new I don't know if you've thought about changing up how to do the strips. That's why I've been following um, Stacy Styles on YouTube, which she was one of my first YouTuber that I've been I followed. I wanted to branch out, try different manis. All right. I haven't decided. Oh, and the reason why I did the pill base is so I can change up my mani uh, for Sunday's game. So I call my manis for Sunday my blue manis, my blue nails. Um, I know I'll be posting during this video in my 
my Facebook group. And most of them are all um, Chase fans. So today is their Red Friday. Well, today is my Blue Friday. So I've been wearing blue all season. Do you have a um, team favorite um, football team? So that's why I wear my blue nails on Sunday. And I normally wear those and keep those for about on for Sunday until like Monday or Tuesday. All right. So we'll see how long. We're actually gonna see. Look at that. That one little spot. See, I'm using my thumb as my tool instead of just my. Next finger is my ring, and what was I? Oh, I remember what I was gonna do with this. Are they the same? No. I don't remember. Okay, so that. Um, bring, ring it in. Now I'm doing drop the ball on the whole finger. I thought I had, was going to do a French, do a, a black and do this as a French tip style. Woo, don't fall on you. Sorry. For bumping you. All right, there's that. Try to get it in the middle. And I didn't, didn't get it quite over enough. There's that. Ah, yet again, not. And yet, if you hear my music, I do not have the rights. I have my radio on. I think I probably, but no one's going to know because no, I'm not going anywhere tomorrow, today, tonight. Tomorrow I work, tomorrow night. So, oh yeah. So we're going to be having a storm brew in tonight and tomorrow. What? Are your plan? What are you doing? Are you 
not preparing thinking or are you preparing i'm not gonna prepare i don't need to because well i have to get out in it tomorrow and oh yeah i know why and then actually i'm gonna double this one so And I shouldn't have put that not right. Because when you double, I recommend starting back here a little bit. So then you're not making a ridge for your next to your cuticle. Because then that's where my biggest pet peeve is. Is when I get a ridge when it starts growing out and then it snags on my hair. And... Amanda does not like that. All right. I should actually, I need to get me an intro and figure out what I need to say on my, because I am a color street stylist. Not your typical one. And now, Set up. And the reasoning I want to start doing videos sharing my Manny's applications is because there's not many vid, um, channels on here that share their Manny's. They're mostly application videos. And I know how to put them on. I want to learn, want to see everybody else's techniques for having how to make what they do. So, all right. Since I'm doubling this one, I'm going to show you what I mean by not putting it up here. I'm going to move it back a little bit. There we go. See? And now, this side. Oh, come on. And of course. I stretched it too much and I ruined. Let's see if I can fix that. That'll work. All right. You see what I was doing? Okay. I have a, um, um, what is it? VIP club on Facebook and I will link that down below in the description. I'll share the sets that I used. Um, the only there, I only have one not um, one retired set, and that's the glitter sweep. All right, we're almost done putting these on. And then we'll add the decorations. All 
Okay. I should have. Ah, Lord. I'll fix that. I was trying to stretch it because I didn't square off the bottom of my this one. I can actually go straight down in the center. All right. This side was on that. I'm going to do that. And look, I doctored him right back up. And there's no one's going to know. Okay. I need a little bit more gold. There we go. Let's check on this side. And I'm not going to edit because I don't know how to edit since I'm recording on my phone when I upload. All right. So. I'm. We can literally go out the door just like this. But. I'm not. I'm going to. Now. Take this gold here. So I'm going to get gold and Sponge it, put it on my sp sponge, and then take, I did get some of that, um, 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 like take latex, take latex glue and put, but I did not like that. when it comes to removing. So you can see the difference. This one has the um, gold flakes and this one does not have the gold flakes in yet, on yet. I need some more. So what the, it does is the sponge soaks up the the liquid and just leaves the flakes so you can put flakes the, gl the glitter flakes on your now I have I um I have the the silver I love the silver flakes so I went to the store to get which these, the gl two glitters are at, I got them from Dollar Tree. I think I need one more. 
There we go. I think that's plenty for now. All right, so you just sponge it where on in there. I'll move my flakes around so then they're on there. What I actually need. If you get too much liquid, you just cut the sponge off and then you can start fresh with a new sponge. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. I just like like I wanted. All right, we're done with the sponge and the glitter. Now I'm just gonna take. Oops, put them where I want them. Actually, I want some right on this one. I didn't think I had enough on this finger. All right. There we go. That's done. And now... To doctor these guys up my pointers or index or whatever you call them i call them my pointers i want to get some gold foil so all i need is a little bit because a little bit goes a long ways all right so, and then you can, I got that on Amazon and it, it came with the glue. You can also, I was, I heard to use the liquid when you do the, the glue, you want it very little. And let's go. Do some straight diagonals. And then you want it almost like I didn't put as much on this one. Like this one's almost ready. And on this, you want to see how it curves down. You put this side on your finger. All right. And then you just press and lift, press and lift. There we go. On this one. There we go, my gold flakes. And now, I don't think I'm gonna use the glitter sweet cause I can, now what I'm gonna do is take my northern lights top coat and put on top of everything
The only reason why I w would use the glitter sweet is to put on top of my pointer finger. That would be the only reason I pulled it out. All right. And this is a very quick dry top coat. I like the glitter flakes have not even, they've already set and they're dry. think I got that side. I'll do clean it, measure, clean up off camera. But yeah, it's in a matter of less than 15, less than five minutes, this will be set and dry for me and ready to go. You have a fantastic New Year's, stay safe, and whatever you do, actually, I'm going to do one more coat. I like to do two. All right. And, um... The company that makes this Northern Lights also has a gold gold one. And I think I'm gonna get me a bottle one of these days. That's my my one of my next purchases. Once it all is dry and all that, I will be doing, posting a Nelfi. Thank you for watching. And, and, all right. Have a Neltastic day. Thank you.